Hey, it's Rich Birdsall, and we're here with Rachel Davenport at the Ross Park Zoo. We're gonna check out some odd jobs. I'm Rich Birdsall, say hi. Hello. So, the first zookeeper that you are gonna be shadowing today is mm -hmm. Sarah. Okay, what does Sarah do? Sarah, actually her specialty is down here. She deals a lot with the howler monkeys, red pandas, and barnyard as well. Perfect, I howl as well. Let's get this yes. done. <laughs> So we're here to showcase the jobs that you do. So if you want us to come to your place, please go ahead and send me an email, rich at 981thehawk.com. Let me know after you get permission. I don't want you getting fired, which is why I asked her to ask that. Anyway, what are we doing? We're in the tortoise thing and we've got some buckets of water. What's going on? Yep, so we have a bucket of water. Mm -hmm. We change out all of their waters every day. So yep. we're gonna dump their old water and refill it. Um, we also have a waste bucket right. um, for all of the waste they're going to be awesome. using. Yeah, we don't need right. dehydrated turtles. Let's go. I'll, I'll take the heavy one. <laughs> all right. You hungry, buddy? Yep, Look. we just got a salad. He's eating exactly what I eat every day. So we can just dump it like right in this area at the corner. Gotcha. Oh, there's some dirt in here. Since there is dirt, what we're also going to do is hand it and hand scrub it. Yeah. <laughs> Lots of sand. They're gonna get all of it. Ta-da. Beautiful. How do I know what is excrement and what is good clean sand? Oh, it's clumpy. Got it. Yep, he leaves some nice big presents. Gotcha. <laughs> if you were ever saying to yourself, those turtles are so cool, I wonder where they go to the bathroom. It's right about there. I just put the poop in the water thing. Yeah. Right? Too much of a mess. Yeah. Everything is dry. I was poking through there. I didn't find any poop. No. It looks like he's good. Tortoises don't go every night, so you uh, you lucked out on this all. Huh. I'm sure there'll be other unfortunate things I'll run into today. Won't I, Sarah? Uh, <laughs> Sorry, Fluff. Sorry there, buddy. This is... This is... Sarah, what made you want to be a zookeeper? Um... Yeah? Um, I really enjoy working with them, even though most of our day is cleaning. Yeah. Um, as long as you can deal with the 80% husbandry, the other 20% we get to train the animals, we get to interact with most of them. The husbandry, what do you mean by that? Husbandry is daily cleaning, feedings, um, right. disinfecting dishes, just making sure they're healthy. It's like how you take care of the animals. Without a doubt. Cool, let's go do some more husbandry. All right. We'll see if I'm fit. <laughs> At this point, I would just use a shop bag. <laughs> no bag? Nope. Ew. So, we just got done cleaning the goat cages, and I don't mind scooping poop, but now, what are we gonna do? You said diets? What are we- We are actually going to the kitchen now. You're gonna be able to chop up some meat, some vegetables. Are there mealworms? Because I won't work in a kitchen unless there's mealworms. There are mealworms. Of course there's mealworms. Oh! <laughs> so now we're in the kitchen with Maria and Courtney, and we're gonna make some delicious food, maybe some on pita bread. What are we doing? You wanna show them? <laughs> we're making meat diets today for the carnivores. Awesome. Too. <laughs> so who are we feeding first? We're gonna make the cougar and snow on their diets first. So how does this work? This, their diet is actually really simple. Mm -hmm. All this is pan of meat. Gotcha. They're kind of panda? No. Panda meat? Is that no. what you Nope. Oh, it's I was like, we're, pan of meat. I like pandas, <laughs> no. so it's just a pan of meat. Got pan it. Pan of meat, yeah. Silly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, too much, you gotta take out four ounces. Let me see how close I am, ready? There you go. Uh, well, we've got uh, Purina dog food, just your basic, I'm sorry, you have to close the camera, basic dog food, and that's gonna, chicken what is this? Flavor. This is gonna add some crunchy and some yeah, chicken flavor yeah, to the beef. And... 
got there? So this is a bloodsicle that's given to, <laughs> to the cats and it has a little bit of chicken in it. Big cats. And you said this is wolves, right? This is a wolf as well. Yep. And otters. We're going to go ahead and fish to that in a little bit. But uh, hey, I appreciate hanging out with you very much. Welcome. One bloody handshake to another. Hey. Thanks for hanging out with me. And uh, we got to mix meat. I feel like going, uh, I'm vegan right now, but maybe we should, uh, what do you think, Ash? You want to give me some of this? We're back here with Courtney. You remember her from In the Kitchen? And uh, we're going to go inside and going to do what? Uh, we're going to be cleaning half the den, at least. The den. The yeah. den of what? Uh, the tigers. Oh! <laughs> Uh, is that why Rachel told me not to put my fingers in? Yes, yeah, yeah, don't put your fingers. <laughs> nice kitty. Right. Come on in. It's a lot of box. Yes. Big cat. <laughs> Alright, that's it for this episode of Odd Jobs with the Rich Bird. So thanks so much yes. for our butterfly pictures and everything we got to do today. I can't, I mean, there's no other place else that you could work uh, besides the zoo where I could say that I actually got in and got to play with blood and, yes. you know, feed tigers and stuff and clean their pets. So that was pretty awesome and uh, we appreciate it. If you want to uh, have us show up at your odd job, please by all means email me, rich at 981thehawk.com and hopefully Ashley, the one running the camera, will put it at the bottom of the screen there for you. Uh, also, it's Zookeeper Week. What's the deal with that? Yeah, so this week we're actually celebrating National Zookeeper Week. Yeah. It's an event um, being held all over the country. Um, we are just highlighting our zookeepers and everything that they do to um, help with the animals and work with them every day. And show them off. It's a heck of a job. Blood on your fingers every day. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thank you. Is that an actual owl?